Alright, here's my GMP LMT. Uh, this gun goes for, say, around 360 on EVIC. I got it off eBay off of some guy for cheap. Um, perfect condition, though. Um, I did quite a bit to this gun. Uh, I wrote all of it down. Uh, like I said, it's a GMP LMT. It's got the Rex or REX red dot with different reticles. Uh, it's the real steel version. Let's see if I can get that on camera. Maybe not. I don't know if you can see that. It's got a bunch of different ones. Anyways, um, the real steel REX red dot. It's got the PTS Magpul back flip up sight right there. And then uh, this came with the gun when I got it. A little front iron sight. I uh, put some tan rail covers on there. I don't know if I'm going to keep them or not. They're alright though. And it's got the Skull Frog flash hider. Um, it's got little sling attachments right here that you can just push button sling mounts that you can pull off and put all over the gun. I have two of them. The other one's on my sling right now. I have the mag pole vertical grip or angle grip, whatever. Um, red dot and then pressure switch flashlight that I just got from like Walmart. Um, for trademarks. There you go, LMT lower. I mainly got this gun for this upper receiver, just because it kind of looks like the Voltor upper. There's another trademark on the rail. Um, Voltor stock, which for this Voltor stock, uh, I have an 11.1 .1 lipo on this Voltor stubby stock. Uh, I took the sides off and cut the insides out and then uh, placed them back on with the battery. And I have a MOSFET in here too, it all fits, works just fine. Um, I'll put that back on later. Um, Alright, let's see, for the internals, back to that. Um, It's got the uh, Murph Gate 3.2, 3.5, one of them MOSFETs with three on burst and I actually have it wired to the trigger connections. Um, 11.1 LiPo and it's got a uh, this threaded cylinder. I'm going to put all the actual names on uh, the description below. It's got a full metal air nozzle with the O-ring. Um, Got a piston or a full metal teeth Swiss cheese piston, uh, a piston, a uh, full metal piston head. Which, like I said, I'm gonna leave all the names to this on the description below. Um, so it's got a double O-ring cylinder head, and it's got some 13 to one uh, SHS gears, uh, M120 spring. And then it has a tight bore inner barrel. I think it was like 250 millimeters long. And uh, element high speed motor. And uh, with the MOSFET that I've wired to the trigger, it's pretty beast. Here's the uh, three arm burst. And then here's full auto. It's a fucking beast. Pardon my French. Um. I think that's about it. I was gonna make the little custom hair trigger just so you barely touch the trigger and it shoots by uh, putting some solder on the trigger connections. Still gonna mess around with that. Um, I haven't really seen any videos of that yet, so maybe I'll make a little video of doing that. The little hair trigger. But that's my custom GMP LMT. Thank you.